took two steps to the left. Sat down. Bright and early right here in Wyoming. Let's see if we can get something going. got a group of coyotes howling back his way. Nothing howled out in front of us. So we're gonna kind of quiet call this, play some pup right here. Let's make it about a 10 minutes stand or something. If we don't show up right here, we're gonna move right over there and try these coyotes. Pretty good smell first thing in the morning, right? That's right. <laughs> the cow come out of nowhere. Come out of that sun. Yeah. Yeah, that's a pretty good start to the morning. Right here at sunrise, we got the coyote down. We're running the uh, backup call, Fox Pro CS24C. Getting the job done, we'll go up and get this coyote. Phew, we I'm breathing hard. This little bit of elevation change for this eastern boy, rough. Anyway, we got the coyote down. Little fluffy joker for spring. Big old coyote feel. Look at that joker. Look at all the hair. He does know that's maybe the first time I've ever seen a tick in Wyoming. Absolute gorgeous coyote. Hold this feel, I'll pick that thing up. Mm-hmm. Believe how fluffy he is. Awesome. First day in the morning. Pretty good. We actually caught coyotes up on the first day in the morning yesterday. Oh, we had a little didn't do too good, did it feel? Yeah, he flubbed up a little bit. Shot about I don't know, maybe that high that high over top of a coyote. Easy shot. 
Whatever. Anyway, go out down. Well, it's a pretty good way to get to get the morning started. Coyote right here at sunrise, and we're keeping it pretty simple on this trip because, like I said uh, uh, previously, you know we actually come on this trip to do some turkey hunting. But we tagged out early, so we're making some coyote stands and doing pretty good. We're calling about 50% on stands, and we're running pretty light, running a Fox Pro CS24C and using Swagger Bipod Stalker lights. I mean, you know, you don't get much lighter than that running. Um, I'm actually shooting my brother's rifle. This is a Hager 6.5 PRC and it absolutely devastated this big male coyote. Very fun stand. We started a stand off with uh, young coyote howls, just three howls. Uh, we immediately had a had a group of coyotes answer us right over, you know, back in behind us. Uh, they was way off in the distance. I don't even know if the camera could hear them. Uh, we decided just to call this stand real light. So we just tried to coyote pup 314. Run it on probably I don't know, about 26, 28 volume on this CS24C, and it didn't take long. Seven or eight minute mark. Big old fluffy male coyote right up here on this ridge. He uh, sure was scanning the area. He wasn't for sure to come all the way in. It was about 190, 200 yard shot. He sat down up here, actually switched to 10 town pups. I uh, thought maybe switching it up might get him to come on, you know, make him advance further. Anyway, had a good shot here. Like I said, about 200 yard shot. Went ahead and took it as he was sitting on the ground there absolutely smoked him another coyote down thanks for joining us on tooth and claw tv